Yo, this is the fucking worst. Somebody tell me how... Actually, let me go to options. I'll check out options. Look at how... Let me just show you. Well, first, look at how many fucking... Like, no wonder it takes five days to verify the replay data. Look at how many fucking replays there are. Now, look at how long it takes to delete one. This is to delete one. This is ridiculous. But yeah, I'm trying... Because it takes... I thought... You know, I've been playing... I haven't really been playing much Blaze Blue. But I've been playing a fair amount of Street Fighter, and I thought checking downloadable content. Shit. Oh, we don't care about display. How do we. Oh, I don't care about that. Okay. We can get rid of all of that, so no more of that shit. But there's no way to automatically... Son of a bitch. There's no way to automatically kill. Damn, man. Because oh, I don't want to... Uh, it takes so long at the start to verify replay data. Like, now that I've downloaded the costumes in Street Fighter... It takes ages. Oh, I need to check that person's message. Oh, yeah, I know. It takes ages. <laughs> they asked me for advice on Azrael, and I said, go nuts, but unpredictable nuts. That's Azrael. Oh, also, actually, now that I'm fucking thinking about it, let me actually go check this. I heard recently, oh, there's only 16 people here anyway. I heard PSN's actually kind of been a piece of shit for the past week or so. That connections are just utterly terrible. Like, there's been just a bunch of, like, forced disconnections. And, um, you know, three bars become... Like, basically what you saw in my last ranked match. Where three bars just become, like, zero bars or some shit. So let me check this out. Did anybody reply to me nobody replied to me nobody loves me nobody loves me I asked if it was still because they were talking about it and I asked yeah I don't know there's no really like definitive answer about whether or not shit sucks But from what I've heard, shit sucks. Maybe I should. You're just gonna get like a 30 minute video of me doing nothing but deleting replays. <laughs> there will be nothing else because there's nothing else to do. I mean, all these connections currently do suck. I mean, aside, you have these two, two bar people. Maybe shit out of luck. Because, like, I'm sure I need to just try. And I guess I can join that one. I need to just try and get into, um... Uh, what's it called? Playing, not get into playing, but start playing later on in the day. Because, obviously, this is a time where most people that are going to play are going to be playing this like most of the people that are going to be playing at this time are going to be like east coast time zones or it's you know nighttime right now in europe so there would be a lot of european play well i don't know why there would be european players in an east coast lot well east coast that i mean granted i should probably learn this and have at least a basic knowledge of geography so that i don't end up sounding like an idiot about this but it's entirely possible that, um, the East Coast, at least, like, Far East Coast, like, New York, places around there, eh, fuck it, let's use Dave, um, are closer to Britain, you know, England, places like that, than the West Coast is, 
Because the West Coast is fucking huge. I mean, not the West Coast. The United States is enormous. It's people are just like, you know, I, I have some friends from Europe. And obviously the viewers from Europe. But I don't think I've ever talked about it with you guys. But it's just like... A regular trip for me. In state. From where I am to Southern California. It's like... Six, seven hours without traffic from here to LA, and about eight or nine hours to get from here to San Diego, which is about as south as you can get and still be in like a decent rural, rural area. Whereas with like Britain, if you drive more than two hours from like edge to edge, you're in the ocean. I did that. I didn't react in time. Stupid me to hit a button. Oh, that was not the overhead. Okay. Fucking Subaki. Yo, this, is this dude doing combos? Damn, I tried to 2C it. I hate Subaki. I deserve that. At least I didn't get perfected. <laughs> I haven't, I mean, like what? The last, I think the last Subaki I played was in the last video, like a really long time ago. Son of a bitch. We all know what that was, and it would have fucking worked. That sucks. I this person knows their character and I don't, and it shows. By the way, fuck everybody that says Subaki can't do damage. What? Thanks, Burst. Asshole. <laughs> Came back right on the last hit of me dying. Couldn't have come back one before. Fucker. It's not how much faster that is. Kudos to this dude. This dude knows Subaki. That wasn't a bad connection either, so. Please select your character. But yeah, but I absolutely cannot compete with this guy with Tager. My Tager sucks. Tager can definitely fight in that matchup. It's just very. It's very difficult, requires a lot of patience on the part of the Tager player because the Subaki can easily just do what that player did. Come in, block string, stop before it gets unsafe, confirm that I'm not getting hit by it, air dash out, reset the neutral, and Subaki's gonna win in neutral. And like, if Subaki isn't magnetized, they can just run away and get as many stocks as they want. And that's why you saw basically every single combo this player got on me was like. 3.5k, 4k plus. Because that's, I mean, Subaki does damage when she has stocks. It's just she usually doesn't manage that much damage because a lot of characters that can actually chase her down don't allow her to get charge easily. And that's why Subaki's considered a weak character is because, you know, it's hard for her to get stocks if you're not chasing. You're a character, like Bang, for instance, can easily chase her down. His movement is some of the best in the game. Although this player isn't utilizing it at all. Come on, Bang. Yes. No. Oh, 
Fucky. Come on, son. Don't just go balls in on me and land like every single combo you ever have and then miss all of them on this dude. Don't do me like that. Where's the anti air, man? Tsubaki's got one of the best anti airs in the game. This has to be. This must be like a laggy piece of shit. It just. Everything about how, like, the reactionary shit. Basically, everything that is happening right now just screams, this is laggy. Isn't her command grab a charge roof? I mean, it's probably the same exact thing as Kagura. I, I don't even know. I know so little about- there's just some characters in the cast that I just know nothing about because nobody really plays them. Tsubaki is definitely one of them. Amane is kind of another one, just in general because like... I mean, Amane is not exactly a complicated character to begin with, so it's not bad to not really know anything about him. Because, I mean, it's like, drills level you up if you see a drill. Either get the fuck away. Uh, either get the fuck away, or barrier it so you don't get shipped out. That's really all there is to it. And, like, other than that, you just have to block. It doesn't really have any mix-up. It's just the, you know, being careful, not letting them, um, get the stock. Look how fast that was! I love it! It's too bad that... Nobody else has that set anymore. Like, I think everybody has it. Because I think it automatically... Well, there's an option at the beginning that says, Do you want to automatically save your replays? And I'm pretty sure everybody clicks yes on that. Please select your character. Platinum the Yo, Platinum, this is the lobby of just unknown characters. Underplayed characters. And here comes my ass about to use Asriel to break it all up. <laughs> Oops. That's what you get for being a fucking tear horn, Nate! Fucking jump into Asriel. Cause you suck and you need a character to cover your weaknesses. I've heard that so many times. Everybody that plays Azrael, like nobody could possibly like Azrael the character. They're all just playing him because he's top tier. Yep. That's it. I just wish like there are some there are so many classes in high school in the school system that's like it's absolutely mandatory that you must take these classes. But never anything useful. I don't say never. But like... Firstly... Taking 12 years of English classes is completely and utterly unnecessary and a waste of time in the first place. Now, even then, you have to admit, despite the fact that we are teaching 12, well, no, I actually had enough to take. No, I did have to take an English class my senior year. Because I actually got out of. I literally. This is what happened. The plotting of Nate. I had the worst English teacher in the fucking world as a senior. Like, I would have killed myself. This is not an over exaggeration. I literally would have killed myself to get out of the pain. It is an over exaggeration. But really, I would have pondered killing myself. For the entire hour that I was always in that class, it would stop once it was over. It'd be like, okay, never mind. Life's not that bad. It's only when I'm in this class that life is bad enough that I want to kill myself. But it was just one of the worst teachers I've ever had in my life. And I was in AP German at the time. And I knew 100%. I, I knew some basic German. You know, I did learn some stuff when I was there, but that I was not fluent enough to pass the AP German test. There was no way that was going to happen. So I actually found out the exact period that this teacher did not teach English. And I went to my German teacher and said, Hey, 
Uh, it was actually it was a, the second. It was a German two class, and it actually worked out perfectly for me because my sophomore year, which I took my German two class, I was actually very sick for a lot of it. I ended up getting these just chronic migraines that made it to the point where I like I could not leave my room. I couldn't do anything if there was any sound, any light. I was just like in the worst pain possible. It was a bad time. And so I actually ended up missing a bunch of school. I actually had to go to summer school to make up uh, two classes. But I failed because of that. And um, and so I basically went to my teacher and I said, Yo, there's no way I'm passing this AP German test. You and I both remember I missed about a quarter of the year. Because I was out in my second year. In my second year. Can I come back into German too? So I can relearn all that stuff and solidify my knowledge of German. Completely bullshit. I didn't give a shit about learning German. But I just wanted to get out of that class. And so I got out of the class. I did all of that solely so I did not have Please that English teacher anymore. Alright, son. Let's do this. Ran straight back to my main. But that's how bad that English class was. But even then, okay, just to get back on point. All you have to do is read the YouTube comments of any video, basically any video that has gotten more than like 10,000 views and you will see just how much of a failure those 12 years or however many the people have been through are in terms of speaking, uh, terms of teaching English where people don't even know how to use the basic forms of to they don't know how to use the basic forms of uh, there, your, that kind of shit like it's not even getting into proper like sentence structure you know where to put prepositions how to use adjectives how to use pronouns blah 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 none of that shit the basic shit that you should know by the time you're in like second fucking grade how does that is that really safe like being able to dash like that that's safe apparently those person's hella scared. Fuck, I hit JA. That was obviously a mistake. Yo, I'm so slow right now. Son of a bitch. Yo, that was so scrubby on my part. Ah, I keep forgetting you can't. You gotta press A. Ow, that sucked. Thanks for the auto correct. Fuck you, Blaze Blue. <laughs> okay, okay, alright, alright, good reaction. Not a reaction, that was an auto. That was because I'm autopiloting. Every fucking time I keep. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, fuck it, I'm playing like an idiot. God damn it. No more playing like an idiot, Nate. Dude, the fact that that doesn't fatal pisses me off. Where was my jump? Where was my jump? Where was my jump? 
Fraudulent as fuck! I tried to, cause I know you can confirm. I, you, it's obvious that six C's, um, time that you can confirm off of a fatal, far less than five C. Because you can confirm five C into, uh, what the fuck is that? How can I forget? Oh, I've forgotten the names of all his moves. Dude, seriously, what's that move called? <laughs> I've forgotten the name. Holy shit! How can I forget the names of my main character's moves? Um. Please select your character. Are you kidding me? Two Subakis? Is hell on earth coming? Like, is this is this the like heralding of the apocalypse? What is going on? Two Subakis? I cannot believe. I cannot remember this. Dude, this is terrible. <laughs> Valiant charge! Jesus Christ! You can confirm 5C fatal into, into Valiant, but you can't confirm- I, Obviously, you can't confirm 6C. Don't skip the- Oh, my bad. I was just about to say, don't skip the intro, and I started mashing because I'm an idiot. Well, that's a good fucking start. Oh, okay, we're gonna play like a fucking frog. Noted. Is that air unblockable? Yeah, okay, 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 I get it. Oh, it's also laggy as shit. Yeah, okay. Alright, I understand. I completely get it. I completely understand this player now. If it's possible to do something fraudulent, they are going to do something fraudulent. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, sure, I didn't like that. Safe, okay. I don't know Subaki. I get it. I understand you. See, that's the worst part. You go against somebody that knows exactly what the fuck they're doing, but they're far too patient. That's That Tsubaki player is a good Tsubaki player, but they were quite obviously just scared out of their wits by Asriel. And they shouldn't be like... they. I mean, well, no, you should kind of be, but not that badly. Whereas that person ain't scared of nothing. Select your character. That kind of person is not worried about a damn thing. They're just doing shit.
And so going from a person that's playing the same character, that's really patient, knows their frame traps, knows when to stop, knows their mix-ups, versus somebody that's just gonna go ham on you and go random and do like, if it's possible to do something scrubby in a situation, they're gonna do the scrubby thing. You have to make a rapid adjustment there, and if you don't, you lose rounds. And I almost did, I almost lost to that dude. It's gonna be a bad idea, but I'm gonna do it. Yep, see, bad idea. Okay, that has a good hitbox. Uh, thanks for the back dash. That sucks. Thanks for the... Damn, I'm playing like a fucking idiot again. <laughs> I haven't stopped playing like a fucking idiot, let's be honest. Nice barrier block. Oh shit. That sucks. Doesn't suck anymore, that was a bad combo. Tech plate. Gonna beat the spamming. Damn it! Thanks, Azreal, for turning the wrong goddamn way! Uh, oh, nice. I didn't even- I wasn't even paying attention to that. Told you, I'm playing like a fucking idiot. I'm too tired to pay attention to shit, man. Bad. What? like a fuck like that entire match was just me playing like a fucking idiot not doing anything right with Azrael. I deserve to lose that one. Oh, like I kept trying cuz the thing you can actually um the thing that I tried to do the last two times I got hit with her DP, you can actually trigger her DP, growler it, absorb the DP with growler and then blow platinum up, you can get a counter hit off of it, you can get a counter hit combo. And I didn't do it, I kept, I like it was in my mind, I was wanting to do it, and I, then I just, I didn't do it, I don't know. Alright, new video.